Starting a new campaign with a well-tested blacklist of poor-performing widgets will help you get to the desired results quicker while at the same time reduce your testing ad spent. This is exactly what Smart Lists functionality automatically does for you without having to manually collect and add poor widgets to your campaigns. In other words, each time a specific widget blocking rule, which is specified in a smart list, blocks a running widget on your campaigns, it will add it to a specific smart list so that you can later reuse them. To create a new smart list, all you need to do is to go to smart list, then click new list. In the create new smart list screen, you will need to specify the following settings. 1. Name of the list so that you can easily identify it later on. 2. Type of list, which by default is blacklist. 3. Select the traffic source you are creating this smart list for. Rev content, Taboola, Content Ad, MGID, Outbrain, AdsKeeper, Yahoo Gemini, Volume DSP, or Run Native. 4. You can optionally add any widgets that you may have already identified from your campaign's history. To manually add multiple widgets to your list, please make sure the widget IDs are separated by commas. 5. Specify one or more automatic rules that will add widgets to this list. This way instead of manually adding new widgets to this list, you can have the system do that for you each time one of the specified rules blocks one or more widgets. 6. In the campaigns reading from this list, you can specify one or more campaigns that you want to share or apply this blacklist to. Also, in case you would like to just collect widgets without applying them to any specific campaign, you can temporarily leave this field blank. Once you're done filling out the needed information, all you need to do is to click save so that the list can start doing its job. To give you a practical example of creating a smart list, we are manually adding a few widgets to the list. Specify the rules we would like to populate this list, as well as three campaigns to the campaigns reading from this list. After saving our new list, the system will automatically block the above specified widgets on all three campaigns. Also, every time one of the rules specified in the rules writing to list block one or more widgets on the campaigns they are running on, the blocked widgets will be added to our smart list. An alternative way to create a smart list using the data from one of your existing campaigns without having to manually copy and paste widgets to a new smart list is to generate it using the blocked widgets of a specific campaign. To create a smart list using your campaign's blocked widgets, go to one of your campaign's widgets tab. Change the widgets view to blocked widgets only. Select all widgets, as shown in this example, then click create smart list. As you may see in the smart list creation screen, the system has automatically inserted the selected widgets or sites in the new list. Now before saving this list, all you have to do is to give this new list a name. Select the automatic rules that you would like to populate this list, as well as add any other campaign you would like to use this list on. As a best practice, we suggest you group your smart lists based on geography, targeted device, and vertical or conversion flow. This way, you will be able to create more reliable lists for later use.